spice things up. We're gonna try the All Blacks gym workout. Let's go. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. Oh, oh yeah, please, fellas. Start putting deodorant on. Save a nose. You could save a nose today by putting deodorant on before you leave the house. That is all. Truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. Today's routine I was watching a bit of uh, the All Blacks training workout videos, you know, gym videos, and uh, I just kind of went through a scheme. They didn't give me exact reps and uh, reps and sets, but I'm kind of going off of my own personal, you know, thought um, when I was watching the uh, the video. And what I noticed is I think a lot of things are, you know, strength when it comes to like like a uh, squat and bench. I believe that those were, you know, no more than five reps, no more than five reps. So I'm, I'm guessing they're going, to, they're doing that in between the, you know, five sets of five or five sets of three. Some sets were even two, so they could have did, you know, two sets of three, two, uh, I mean, three sets of three and the last two sets of two, you know. And uh, so I think we're going to go with that process. They were going max effort, um, so we'll be doing that along with, you know, things like pull-ups, just body weight, non-weighted. Um, for reps, uh, probably am rap as you know as many reps as possible. So we'll be going through that today, and uh, yeah, let's have some fun. And we did 20 minutes right here on the uh, soul bike. Soul bike 20 minutes. They didn't use an assault bike. They used to use a regular uh, bike, but I used the assault bike, and I'm uh, warmed up and uh, ready to go. I'm gonna do trap bar, squats, deadlifts, whatever you wanna call it, is because I did squats literally yesterday. And on top of that, I have a somewhat of a, a hamstring tear. So we're gonna kinda of modify it. That way I'm still working the legs, still getting that same type of workout. Actually, I mean, uh, exercise. And uh, actually doing a little bit more. A little bit more back engagement. Still using the glutes, the quads. And um, we're still gonna, that's this way I'll be able to pretty much you know, haul ass on this exercise. Especially like when sports training, a lot of times they're a superset. So I'm about to get to my working set, and we're going to superset with pull-ups. So we're going to do the uh, trap bar, squats, deadlifts, whatever you want to call it, and then we're going to go and do pull-ups right after. We usually do a neutral grip, neutral grip, wide grip, whatever, whatever stands. But mainly, I know a lot of athletics they stick to uh, neutral grip pull-ups.
straps should be used more often. It's not taking away anything, just a little bit of grip. But I'll sacrifice the grip to be able to focus on lifting the weights a lot more. So, use straps. Very beneficial. And I feel like a lot of people sleep on it. Even when it comes to, I feel like people don't use it when they're going for a PR or something. You can get a lot more reps in using straps. Y'all are going to start seeing uh, um, uh, Mr. Belt Beckham because I've been starting. I, I didn't been. I've been using a belt for like the last week, and this is probably the belt that comes with the gym that allows me to use it. Has been like the most perfect belt for everything: squat, bench, and squat, deadlifting. It's been perfect. It allows me enough space to breathe in it. My belt's a little bit too thick and too tight. That belt is perfect. At first, I thought it wasn't going. At first, I thought it wasn't going to work, but I think I think I might actually buy the damn belt from the gym. Be like, yo, like, you know what I'm saying? So we got bench, same concept as before. sets of three and then uh, two sets of two to do this because that's what it seemed like they were doing in the video so and I'll link the video down below of what I'm kind of referencing off of and then we'll go from there We got single leg kettlebell, uh, straight leg deadlifts, pretty much. Hip hinge, stand on that leg stationary. I'm gonna take my shoes off, get a little bit more toe action, work this on the floor. And we're gonna do uh, eight to 12 reps each leg for four to five sets.
on to the next exercise. Feel a good uh, stretch and pump in my hamstrings right there. Actually needed that. That felt good on my uh, my injury. So felt like it was kind of taking over and healing. So let's get it. Younger days, I used to train abs. I don't train abs like no more, and I hate doing abs. But we got to finish it off. About uh, four, four. I think it was four sets of ten to fifteen reps. D bar sit ups, weighted. So let's get this shit over with. Ah, that's the workout. 